morning, Greater Latrobe. From the WCA TTV studio, I'm Alexandria Potter, alongside Libby Jones, and these are your morning announcements. Do you want, to, do you want great coffee served by even greater people at the greatest price? Stop by the Cast Cafe for its grand opening on Friday, October 13th for a warm drink and a warm smile. The Cats Cafe is located at the concession stand across from the gym. Drinks such as coffee, cappuccinos, and tea will be, brew will be brewed from seminar until period two and available for the purchase of $1. See you Friday morning. Come out and support the golf team this weekend at the Eastgate Chick-fil-A. If you mention Latrobe Golf Team when you order on Saturday, October 14th, Chick-fil-A will donate a portion of your bill to the golf team. This runs all day long, so just be sure to mention the golf team when ordering. The High Post is looking for then and now pictures. Please email them to Molly Cunningham before the end of this week. There will be a mandatory meeting for all Link Crew leaders on Thursday, October 19th at 6.55 a.m. or 2.30 p.m. in the faculty dining room in the Commons area. Leaders are asked to attend at one of the available times. Please be on time and be prepared to, study, to stay for the entire 30-minute meeting. We will be back after this commercial break. The homecoming dance will take place on Saturday, October 21st from 7 to 10 p.m. in the Senior High Gymnasium. Dance tickets are $20 for singles and $40 for couples and will be on sale starting Monday, October 16th through Wednesday, October 18th. Greater Lake Club freshmen are permitted to attend the dance but are not permitted to bring a guest from another school. Sophomores, juniors, and seniors who are bringing a guest that does not attend Greater Lake Club Senior High must complete a guest registration form prior to purchasing your ticket. You will turn in the form when purchasing your ticket. Guests must have at least sophomore status and must be under the age of 21. Forms are now available in the 9, 10, and 1112 offices and on the Senior High webpage. New this year, the ticket price will include a 5x7 and two wallet professional photographs for each person attending. Following colleges will be in the cafeteria during all lunches. The University of Akron will be here today. Carlo College will be here on Monday. An all-service academy admission seminar will be held on October 17th at Connellsville Area Senior High School for freshmen through seniors. All military academies will be represented, as well as IUP, ROTC, and the PA National Guard Officer Candidate School. Please stop by the 11th, 12th grade office waiting area for more detailed information. Underclass picture makeup for the yearbook will be taken on Thursday, October 19th. If you have not yet been photographed, you will receive a pass this week of the 19th. Pictures will be taken in C-102. There is a brief meeting on Thursday, October 19th at 2.30 p.m. in Mrs. Leeper's room, H206, for anyone interested in joining the mock trial team. Please contact Mrs. Leeper if you have any questions. This week is National School Lunch Week. To celebrate every day, you can choose school lunch. You will be entered into a drawing to win a ticket to the homecoming dance. The winners will be announced on Friday, October 13th. Join us for lunch in the cafeteria and celebrate National School Lunch Week. There will be a meeting for all ninth grade wrestlers today in the corridor at this time. Check into homeroom first and then come to the corridor. If you are a current wrestler or interested in wrestling, you must attend. Now here is Devin Watson with the weather report. Good morning, Wildcat Nation. It's time for your local weather report. You might want to pack up those sun sunshades and try to, try, to, uh, try to trade them in for some umbrellas because it's going to be a very rainy for the next couple of days. Today we will have a high of 67, a low of 52, with rain all throughout the day. Friday, I expect rain to slowly disappear, but I'll have a cloudy day as we head into a high of 70 and a low of 54. On Saturday, those clouds should disappear as the warmer weather heads in with a high of 77 and a low of 60. That's all for your local weather report. Thanks, and back to you. Thanks, Devin. Attention all students interested in participating in either Libraries Book Club or Reading Competition Team. If you have not already signed up, please do so as soon as possible. Signing up for Book Club simply means giving Ms. Rebel your name and or having signed up during the club fair. Signing up for Reading Competition means you have returned the permission form to Ms. Rebel. For both activities, please stop by as soon as possible to pick up your first book. If you signed up but have changed your mind, please let Ms. Rebel know. This month's book club book is The Adoration of Jenna Fox by Mary E. Pearson. In this science fiction story, scientists have the ability to create brains, but it is illegal to do so. 17-year-old Jenna is trying to recover from a serious accident while dealing with memory loss, issues with her family, and the secrets surrounding her father's scientific work and her own recovery. As a reminder, book club members may choose not to participate any month that they don't care for the month's book. 
Greater Lee Trobe is starting a Girls Who Code Club, which will meet Thursdays beginning today after school in room S104. The club is open to any girls interested in learning more about coding and how they can impact their communities through computer science. If you are interested in joining the club or have any questions, please see Mrs. Lint in S104. Do you have a talent? Do you want to show it off to the world but can't find a way to showcase it? We'll look no further. This school year, we are searching for students of all grades to showcase their talents on WCAT TV. If you would like to be on the show, please email Devin Watson for a chance to showcase your talents in our new segment, Hats with Talent. Next week, Greater Lee Trobe will be celebrating Red Ribbon Week and a Spirit Week for Homecoming. Please wear your red on Monday to show your commitment to living a drug-free lifestyle. For WCAT TV, this has been Libby Jones and Alexandria Potter. Thanks for watching and have a great day.